What's up? I'm back in LA and it's freezing cold. It's something like 50 degrees and it's super rainy, which explains my crazy hair and why I'm wearing a warm jacket. I'm standing here in my garage studio where I've crafted some super dope looks using the pieces I thrifted in Hawaii and I mixed and matched with pieces from my own closet. Uh, that's my style. That's my style. All right, so outfit number one, we have the groovy zebra print disco top. This shirt cost me $5. Instead of styling this too literally, I put it with a funky orange grandpa trouser, and I really think this brings it to life in a unique way, especially the color combo, this ice blue with this, what is this orange, like a burnt sienna? The funky grandpa trousers are definitely giving me like a dad vibe. That with this fun disco top, I thought, hmm. Who doesn't want a dad that does disco, right? Outfit number two, we have the Saturday Surf New York t-shirt with the blue and black wavy pattern in the middle. So I found my favorite pair of basketball tearaway pants. These are a light blue and white striped pants. And then I also have this really cute silk blue shirt jacket. So blue, blue, more blue, and stripes and patterns and stripes. This is where I like to have fun with mixing patterns. Don't be freaked out, just try it. Woo, okay, outfit number three. We have the 80s tie-dye shirt. This is the shirt that had the shark on it and that had like a Hawaii message in red letters on the front. Turn things inside out. Sometimes it looks cooler. No offense, shark, you're cool. I thought it would be fun to pair it with my favorite pair of satin sweatpants. That's right, you can call me bougie. But these were also thrifted. By the way, this tie-dye t-shirt cost me $3. Okay, so outfit number four. We have the green polo shirt. This is the Golf Pro polo shirt that I was talking about when I was first back from the thrift haul. This shirt was literally like $2. It looks pretty preppy if you just stare at it, but you know what? I put a neon yellow shirt underneath it for a layer, and then I put that with a heavy rigid dark denim, and just gave it a messy tuck, rolled the sleeves up a little bit, and it just transformed. It kind of made it feel way more punk, way more skater, way more chill, less uptight and preppy. Finally, drum roll please. We have outfit number five, and this is one of my favorite finds of this thrift trip. This bowling shirt is the bomb! I love it so much. It has those blue heron birds on it, or it was pelicans, one or the other. We couldn't really figure that out, but they're birds and they're cool. This shirt was meant to be with these polyester Wrangler trousers that I've had forever. They're a deep maroon color. They just go together. This is for sure like an Aloha Grandpa look, and I'm all for it. All right, so I'm ending my segment wearing my favorite new disco top, zebra print, ice blue number. Why am I touching myself like this? <laughs> Thank you for watching. I've given you five fresh new outfits to be inspired by. I really hope I gave you guys some ideas about how to mix and match, how to play with color, play with patterns, play with different proportions. It's really important just to relax. Just have fun. It's not so serious. Just get experimental. That's what style is all about. Start experimenting. I wanna keep in touch with you guys. If you like what you saw, subscribe to my channel, my so-called style. I like you, do you like me? Let's be friends. Come on, that's cool. Let's do this. All right guys, so um, that's it. That's the end, that's all. All right, thank you so much for watching. Until next time.